do love looking at some of these photos that were sent in. I like this one. Uh, Janice Noyce posted at Utah's Weather Authority Facebook group uh, calling it snow leach, <laughs> the snow and the fall foliage up at Alta. Up at Snowbird, they had six inches of snow or about that, and we had impressive rain totals in the valleys yesterday. Of course, you know it was just pounding down for a while, uh, almost an inch and a quarter at Pleasant Grove. Just shy of that in Salt Lake City, over an inch at West Point, close to that at Dugway, and uh, a little over three quarters of an inch up at uh, Park City. Well, we're gearing up for more wet weather today, but it won't be that heavy. However, in the wake of yesterday's storm, we're off to a cool start. It's 49 right now in Salt Lake City. It's 39 in Price as well as Vernal right at freezing in Cedar City. So you really need a good jacket. And in St. George, it's currently 50. We've got fair skies in the south, clouds in the north uh, with a few showers to the north of us because even though our main trough low pressure is moving off to the east of us, there's another disturbance rotating around that that's dropping in from the Pacific Northwest. That'll bring us wet weather today, uh, but the orange and the red here indicate by the middle of the week, high pressure builds in from the west, and that's what will be not only drying us out, but warming us up quite a bit. Now, before that today, we'll have that chance of some showers, mainly in the north. In fact, the best chance of the valley rain mountain snow will be north of I-80. A few showers could pop up south of that, uh, but they're not going to be very widespread. And it looks like a lot of that then just tapers off this evening. Salt Lake City, we're expecting to climb to 57, so it'll feel a lot like it did yesterday. Still well below normal for this time of year. It'll be 47 in Park City. Uh, you'll make it up into the low to mid 60s in a lot of the central valleys and in St. George, 73. And while we're dealing with the wet weather in the north, central and southern Utah will be partly cloudy today, but with high pressure building becoming sunny tomorrow with that big warm up. In fact, temperature climbs all the way up into the mid 80s heading into the weekend in St. George. And in Salt Lake City, it's going to be sunny, several degrees warmer tomorrow. We'll climb into the mid 60s. We'll make it up near 70 by the end of the work week and all the way up into the low to mid 70s just in time for the weekend.